today I'm gonna be doing a back to school clothing haul. Yeah, sorry I kinda look like a mess. I was shopping this morning, then I just came home and showered, and then now I am filming this video. But I did get a lot of clothing for oh, there she is stretching. I did get a lot of clothing. I probably will be going back in maybe towards the end of this month because this is only August 2nd and I don't start start school till August 29th. But I probably will be going back at the end of the month to get a little bit extra things, maybe like just extra stuff like jackets, more leggings, undergarments, just the other things that I don't necessarily need, but stuff that I will want. So first we're going to start with my backpack. I am going to be a senior in high school, but I, every single year I do get a new backpack and it's never a plain backpack. I always get characters. I usually get the Vans backpacks that are with the collaboration with someone, but this year they collabed with Marvel and I'm not into Marvel in any way, shape, or form, but I am into Rick and Morty as you can tell. Um, I'm literally, uh, Rick and Morty is one of my, is my favorite TV show in the whole entire world. Me and my boyfriend watch I've watched every single episode and we are waiting for the new ones. And I just love Rick and Morty. So I got this backpack. Um, this was $36.90 from Hot Topic. But I did have a coupon for my birthday because I am a, not a member, but I have like a rewards thing. And so I only got this for $20. But it has some side pockets for like water bottles. This is actually clear to make it look like they're sitting in their spaceship and then just has a big pocket and then the straps just look like that so then I went to Nordstrom's rack I've never sorry I've never shopped there before I didn't really know what it was I thought things were a lot cheaper but it's just really high priced things for cheaper but it's still high priced for me because yeah but sorry for the gringling I got two things. This is ridiculous. I got two things from Nordstrom Rack. I got these pair of really nice, like, thick leggings because I did get another pair from Forever 21, but we all know those are pretty thin and a good chance of them being see through. So I got a size large. I hope that fits. Probably will fit me. They're just plain black by the, by the brand Zella. I've never heard of these before. They're just black leggings, has this on the back, and then these I bought for $26.97, which is still pretty expensive for just some plain black leggings, but they are thick, they are gonna be worn. Okay, then the second thing I got was this bralette two-pack. I got this for $19.97, it's just a navy one and then a black and white stripe one. I already have a, a plain black and a plain gray one, and I absolutely love those things. I just wear them over my bra, or I wear them to bed. But they are the most comfortable things ever, and I always wear a bralette over my bra. I don't know why. I just have like I just always do, or I'm wearing a sports bra. But these are everything. They're so comfortable. And they're just everything. And I only got two for twenty bucks, which is not bad. Hot topic is where I shop first, and my total was. A hundred and four, a hundred and three dollars and one cent. But you're gonna some hack, hot cash, so. And I also got a lot of things, a lot of t-shirts. So I am living it up. So first, there was a deal that was buy two t-shirts, get one free. So I got six t-shirts because I always wear t-shirts. Why are these doing this? So to start off with, I just got this Link 182. Um, band t-shirt I guess and the back is just white I'm not really a fan of white but they wouldn't have this in any other color and I really like blink and I don't have any like I don't have a lot of band t-shirts I just have a torn on pilot one from their concert and then a panic of the disco one because I'm going to their concert but yeah so I have that one and these are all going to be the same price I'm pretty sure all $20.50 but I did buy two and I got one free so, got that one. Then, I got this Studio Ghibli Spirited Away black t-shirt. If you guys don't know this about me, Studio, I mean, Studio Ghibli is iconic. But Spirited Away is one of my favorite all-time movies ever. 
And this isn't a woman's extra large because their size in there is whack. I don't know what they did, but, like, size medium is now extra large. Like, it's so weird. Like, size medium is, the like, literally an extra, extra, extra small. It's so weird. I do not understand what they did. So, in the women's section, I'm a size extra large, but in the men's, I'm a size medium. So, I don't get it. But, got this t-shirt because I love it. Then, um, like I said, I'm obsessed with Rick and, Rick and Morty. They, they had, they only had this shirt in a size extra large, but I really like it because I like tie-dye and it's just a plain t-shirt with Morty running in the corner and the back is just plain. And none of the other Rick and Morty shirts even had a size extra large because I think everyone's realizing that the sizes are really off. So everyone who's a size medium is buying extra larges and then the only size available, thought the store is literally a medium and a small because no one fits that. If you guys are not aware of the greatest things in the world, Hot Topic is now selling Lisa Frank and Spongebob collab, collab items and they have a lot of shirts and I bought three of them and I want to go back and buy more because they have a shirt that looks like the in and out but it's for the Krusty Krab but it's in white and I don't really wear white because... but I have this, um, let me take off the sticker, sorry, I hope the sticker wasn't blocking anything else. I have this t-shirt, it is um, a blue and white wash, and it has came up, came tied up, and it just has Patrick and Spongebob, Spongebob, and then Elisa Frank Tiger with the gumball machine, and then these shirts were $24.90, but they were buy two, get one free, and look how cute this tag is, I'm literally going to cut it off and keep it, I'm going to hang it up somewhere in my room, like, look how cute that is, that's so cute. So you got this one. It also in a size extra large because these sizes were also whack. I don't know. Then I got this one in a size extra large. And this one is another tie-dye. I really like tie-dye shirts. But I have this tie-dye t-shirt with Spongebob and um, Krabby Patty that says Lisa Frank. And then the back is just like this. But this is like, tie-dye is like iconic in my wardrobe, t-shirts are iconic in my wardrobe, and I have a lot of tie-dye t-shirts, <laughs> or black t-shirts, I don't know what it is, but I did get this one, this one is a men's size medium, see, I'm a, like, this is a size medium in men's, it's just a plain shirt on the front with a Spongebob and Lisa Frank's logo on the pocket, and then the back is Spongebob riding a unicorn, and I absolutely live for that. And it's just cute because I like pocket tee shirts like this. They're just really cute and basic and simple and very nice to have. So that was a size medium. And then the last place I went to was Forever 21. I actually went, I actually shopped online from Forever 21 about two weeks ago and I filmed a video and I ended up not liking it because I bought three shirts, two of the shirts did not fit me. So I'm trying to resell them on Poshmark. I still actually still have them, but not even worth showing you because they don't fit me but I did buy this cute keychain because I like dinosaurs and it's a puffball and it's just cute and then I bought a whole bunch of pairs of socks because I have a really bad obsession with Forever 21 socks because if you guys do not if you guys are not aware where have you been but um they're just iconic and every time I go I end up coming out with like five ten pairs and that's what happened today but I wear slides a lot. I really like slides, like Nike slides, Adidas slides, and stuff like that. I have, I've been wearing my Nike slides a whole lot, and I just wear cute socks with them. I'm not gonna show you the ones that I got previously because I did get over like 15 pairs of socks, and they are already off the tag and like wrapped up or like folded over each other, and some are dirty, so it's just not worth my time. But just know I literally have over like 50 pairs of their socks. But I did buy more today. So, so my total at Forever 21 was $114. But I did get a lot of good things. And each of the socks are $1.90, so about two bucks. And I got these socks with tacos and hot sauce. And I like the different like colors on the heel and whatever that is. I like that. Then I got these ones with pho or ramen on them. I got these ones of pigs flying. I got these ones with fries on it. 
I have these sushi ones. I have like 12 pairs of sushi ones because they have so many different kinds. I have these pancake ones. How cute. And then I have these fortune cookie ones. And every time I go, I buy like 5 to 10 pairs. And I just... There's, there's always new ones. And I just... They're so cute. And I just can't get over it. And they're pretty iconic in my closet as well. So I actually bought this shirt online. This is the only shirt that fit me. And I probably even won't wear it a lot because it's long sleeve, but I just couldn't pass it up. This is a size large because I bought it online and I didn't want to it. I didn't want it to be so small. But it's another tie dye shirt with rugrats, and on the sleeves it has the main characters on it, Reptar being my favorite, and then over here as well. And I just thought this was cute, just in case it gets cold one day. I don't know. What if I go to Big Bear? I don't know. I only own like two long sleeves. I usually wear short sleeves because I always sweat. So yeah. I'm sorry with the camera angle mood. I got a stupid scam call and I would answer them because they're from my town. Like it says it's from my town. And I don't know if something important is happening. So yeah. So this is a men's shirt actually. I was going to grab it in a, size, in a color gray. But I saw the pink one and I liked it. Um, I'm obsessed with MTV. I love Teen Mom. Love it, love it, love it. But I also just like love the symbol in general. So I have this MTV top. And I think I was talking about what happened at, when I bought online. I bought a shirt. Oh, I don't know why Forever 21 does this, but all the women's shirts are only cropped. And they're not even just cropped. They are like right, they stop like right here. And like your girl doesn't want to deal with that because your girl is not the skinniest girl out there. And I just don't like to walk around showing off my my stomach because hello I am not skinny thank you very much but I still like to shop with Harvey 21 so I can only shop in the men's section and that's kind of BS but men they do have some cute men's clothes I don't say but I bought online and they had a cute MTV tank top but it was cropped but then they had a plus size version that wasn't cropped so I bought it in the plus size the smallest size that they had and it ended up being the weirdest they had the thickest straps. It was the weirdest cut. I, I don't know. It was not my. It was not for me. So I'm trying to sell that on Poshmark. But I do like MTV, so I did see this one and I picked it up. It is quite large. It's a size medium in men's, and it is like huge. But what I think I'll do is I'll tie it up in the front to make it look cuter. Jeans, leggings, whatever I want to do. This was um, about twenty bucks, and. Yeah, it's cute. And it's also tie-dye. Told you guys, I'm kind of obsessed. The rest I got was pants because they were having a uh, buy one, get one 50% off all denim. And I need jeans for school. Well, first off, I bought these leggings because they had cheap leggings there. But they're like this. You know they're going to be see-through. I got a size large and they were only $3.90. Um, you already know they're going to be sort of see-through. These are just like extra just in case. You can... I kind of see my nail color. I can kind of see my whole hand. Iconic. But just in case, if I really, really have to one day, like if I'm out of all clothes, they're cheap. Or I can wear them around home. You can just wear black seamless chonies. Done. So I haven't bought in jeans in a long, long, long time. And when I usually buy jeans, I go to Hollister because I'm a size 9 and I don't really, I hate trying on clothes. Absolutely hate it. Biggest pet peeve of my life. Hate trying on clothes. Hate it with all my heart. I don't care if it's a shirt. I don't care if it's jeans. I don't care if it's shoes. I hate trying them on. So I kind of stick with the same stores and the same brands and the same sizes. So Hollister, I know I'm a size 9 there. And, but I want, I knew these were going to be cheaper. So I try them on, but I tried them on over my leggings. <laughs> Hopefully that's not a problem. I'll have to try them on after this. But I did get size 29. But I didn't realize that when I was shopping for them, there was different sections. And, like, I got a size 29 from over here because there was ripped jeans. And then I wanted a plain pair of blue jeans just to get a plain pair. And the waist size was, like, way off. But they were both size 29. So even when I was shopping for them, I still had to, like, compare waist sizes because I realized there was, like, so many that were not the same size but they've all said 29 so keep an eye out for that if you guys shop there because that's kind of stupid in my opinion but okay so I got this pair of jeans these ones were 29.90 in size 29 um they're the their boyfriend fit I didn't even know that but they're just cute slightly ripped jeans 
I don't know. I'm going to have to try these on. I'm going to keep the tags on. Um, they come cuffed, which I like. I like... Or one comes cuffed. The other one's not, but slightly. Um, so just a plain pair of jeans. Cute. I hope they fit. Leaving the tag on just in case, because I don't know. I tried them on and everything, but I was wearing leggings under. So this is size 29. These were $29.90 as well. Just know that some of these were 50% off. I don't know which certain ones. These ones are a retro skinny high-waisted stretch. I decided to get one pair of high-waisted jeans because I usually do not stick to high-waisted jeans. But these are just some plain blue high-waisted skinny jeans and size 29. So I should try those on too. Then I got a plain black pair of black jeans because I've never owned a pair of black jeans. What? I know. Um, I, but I really want to get a, I really want to get a pair or two from Hollister because I know they have cute ripped black jeans. Sorry, my shirt feels on my riding up my neck and it makes me mad because I hate that feeling of being like choked. Um, these are size 29. It's called the Sunset Midrise Skinny, and they're just some plain black jeans. How much were these? These were 17.90. So these were the ones that were probably 50 percent off. They're just plain black jeans, but I do want some from Hollister because I love Hollister jeans. Those last me forever and ever and ever, and I know I will wear them forever and ever and ever. And they never let me down, and they have cute jeans, so... Might get a pair or two from that place. I got this pair of jeans, size 29. These were $12.90, so these ones are probably half off, too, because they always do it on the cheapest ones. It's just a plain pair of blue jeans. It's kind of short. And there's no like additional tag. Huh. Well these kind of look really short compared to the other one. Maybe they're high waisted. I don't know. Denim pants, skin, medium denim. Okay, I'm gonna have to try these on. But got those. So living my best life. And the last place I went to was Victoria's Pink. Not Victoria's Secret Pink. But yeah. And then my total there I think was like 30 bucks. Yeah, thirty seventy one. I only got underwear because I didn't have enough money to like go all out. But they have I do have some coupons there, so I definitely will be going back to get either a jacket, get a jacket, get maybe get a leggings, um, some bralettes, bra like just just extra stuff that I will want and need in the future. And they have a really cute jacket right now. It's like a windbreaker and it's like a half mesh, half windbreaker, and I don't even know if it'll look cute on me, but like I high key loved it. But I just got some underwear because I every I need them and I'm low key obsessed with these two. Like every time I go, I always get them. So it was five for twenty eight, and I'm in a size medium in all of them. I just got the seamless pair for um, leggings. I always get seamless ones for leggings. Got this plain black one or black with that design. I got these cute ones. These are all. Um, hipster I think or maybe cheekster I don't know I just kind of grabbed them I think they're either or these ones are cute and then these ones are for sure hipster these are just regular ones I don't run away so yeah so that was all the clothes I got for this first haul I probably will be doing another one because I do have a package coming in from Air Apostle that's actually gonna be coming in tomorrow so I do have a package from them and I got some shorts and I got a romper and stuff and I definitely want to get more plain like v-neck shirts kind of want to go to Charlotte Russe for that because I know they have some maybe even H&M I'm not too sure but uh, Charlotte Russe for sure I do want to get some jeans from Hollister but your girls to work and I also will get a pair of shoes because I always do and then I'm gonna go pink because I'm high key obsessed and then I'll probably go back to Hot Topic because I love their t-shirts and they'll probably have a deal so I'm my best life so that was it for this first part one first edition I don't know I'm not even guaranteed to do the second one I don't know so this was my first edition of my back to school clothing haul. I probably won't be having another back to school clothing haul because I'm a senior this year and I'm graduating. So I better graduate. I will. I love watching these videos so I thought I would do it myself. I hope to have a part two because I love, I don't really love shopping. I love getting clothes and I love buying clothes online. 
but I can't always guarantee my size to be correct, so. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment down below if you guys have any questions or video requests. I will have my social media links in the down in the description box down below. Not links because I'm lazy and I don't really know how to do that. But I will have my usernames in the description box down below. And I recommend you follow me on those because I post on those way more than I post on YouTube. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Hey! Oh, 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 oh.